Welcome to a day in my life with an iPhone 13. So today is a busy day. I have to go out with my brother, film a long video and edit a vertical short one and publish it. I have to get things done, so let's do it. So I do my morning routine as always, the deep breaths, make my bed, showering, walk my dog and take a fast breakfast with a couple of eggs and a avocado. I am going with my brother to film a video while he is working. I film a video with the iPhone while we are on the road to test out the cameras and this is all shot with the iPhone. Alright, so quickly here's my iPhone 13 setup. I am rocking the Starlight Color, 128GB of storage, and sometimes I go caseless around my house, but today is not the case. I am going with this Spigen Ultra Hybrid Mag with MacFit technology, and it's pretty damn good. As soon as we arrived, I make sure I make all the setup works. I put the lens on the camera and in this case I am using the Sigma 16 1.4 with a Sony A6400. Which I mount on my tripod. Then I was seeing and trying different places to film on. First, I get to this one, that don't really convince me because it was pretty dark. Right after that place, I go to another. And set up the voice software and the microphone. Then I set up the angle with the tripod and the Sony. And installed a app from Sony to control the camera for my phone. At this time, I have still left 85% of my battery at the middle of the day, at 12.35 pm. Then, after seeing the camera with the phone, I start filming. And I must say, this angle with this setup with this lighting was incredible. This video that I was filming was about my everyday carry for this year. It was my first video of this type and I really enjoyed making it. Here you can see the behind the scenes. After filming the half of the video, it was time to lunch, so I buy a menu from a near store and eat while I watch some videos, and then continue filming.
and when I finish, I check my phone battery at 3.32 p.m. Then I took a couple of pictures of my microphone and the light I used for the video for continue testing the cameras. I disconnected all of my gear that I used for film the video, the microphone, the USB-C hub, and organized them for pack them on my bag. Because I had some time free, I decided to edit a short vertical video about some clips I had on the gym. So I plug the Mac charger to the wall and start editing. I almost finished but I think I will finish it on home. After my brother finished working we go right to hit the gym. But before that, he had to get his favorite pre, coffee. On Monday we did chest and shoulders, on the Tuesday we did back and biceps, but today we had to hit legs. It's not my favorite day, but you have to do what you gotta do. After grabbing his coffee, we head to the gym. When we arrived, I grabbed the tripod and start filming with the iPhone.
out, we head right to the car and go to home. When we arrived, I put my meal prep into the microwave and drink some pineapple juice. For finish the day, I make my skincare routine and wash my teeth. And then I grab my MacBook from my bag and sit on the living room for finish to edit a vertical video I was about to post. After finish editing the video, I post on all my social media, YouTube, Instagram and TikTok. And I wanted to post on my Instagram stories, but since I have Instagram out of my phone, I have to install it. At this time at 10.04 pm, I had 44% of battery. This was all my activity and scream on time on my iPhone 13 during the day. As you can see, 3 hours and some minutes. Honestly, I think the iPhone 13 is just a warrior. The battery is now lasting the entire day, knowing I have all of these features, including the cameras. After I post that story, I delete the Instagram app on my phone and go right to bed, because I was exhausted for the leg day and actually very tired. So I am gonna get rest for another day in my life. Thanks for watching.